Okay, on this problem, they want you to first decide whether you're looking at the shaded area, which is R sub 5 or L sub 5. And if you look at the first subinterval, you can't really tell because at the endpoint of 0, you have a height of 30, but also at 1, you have a height of um, 30. So let's look at the second subinterval. If they had used the left hand endpoint on the second subinterval, then they would have used the height at 1, and it would have been shaded this direction. And this would have been left hand. This one would have been about the same but this one would have been like this. So clearly it looks like they're using right hand endpoints because on the second subinterval to get the right hand height, that would be like that. This one would be the same, so it's not too much different, but yeah, the right hand endpoint was definitely used on this last um, subinterval. So they are using, or we have a picture of um, the shaded region is definitely looking like it is the right hand endpoints of each sub interval to get the height so r sub six and then now we'll go ahead and compute sorry not r sub six r sub five because there's one two three four five rectangles so computing r sub five we have delta x which is one times your different heights on for the right hand endpoint so um, delta x remembers the length, this length is 1 on each of these. Okay, and so the height for the right-hand endpoint for the first subinterval is 30, and then 18, and then on the third subinterval the height is 6, and on the fourth subinterval it's 6, and then on the fifth subinterval it does look like it's back to 30. So if you add these up, 30, 18, 6, 6, and 30, you should get 90. Now, if they had done L sub 5 instead, the delta x, the length of the subinterval, is still 1, but let's see what would have happened. So L sub 5 would be using this left one, so that would be 30. Now, for, at 1, on the subinterval from 1 to 2, using the left-hand endpoint, you would have also had a 30. So you'd have 30, 30, and then from 2 to 3, you would have had 18. From 3 to 4, it would have been the same. It would have been 6. But at 4, look, it would have just been 6. They wouldn't have had this. This part wouldn't have been used. So you have another 6. So you've got um, 30, 30, 18, 6, and 6, still times the 1. So that's also 90. This is kind of interesting. All right.